Hello everybody, Fixer here. Today I have for you Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons. Love that music. That's beautiful. So anyways, this was developed by Starbreeze Studios, published by 505 Games back in September of 2013. I have already played this game actually, and I believe I played it sometime in 2014. So it's been a couple years since I've played it, and I'll get into the reason why I'm replaying it in a minute. But um, you can get this on Steam. Normally, I think it's ten dollars, but it's always on sale on the Steam sale, and I'm pretty sure it's on Humble as well for like three dollars. In fact, this past Steam sale it was like a dollar fifty, so you can get it for very cheap. And I know I, I say a lot in a lot of my LPs that it's probably best for you to just get the game yourself and play it instead of watching me. And and I'm usually right because I, I do play a lot of story-driven games. I, I play a few walking simulators here and there. You know, games like Firewatch, and I really think that you'll get a better experience doing that yourself than you will watching me. Now, with Brothers, there is no game that is more true. Th that statement is not true for any other game as much as it is for Brothers, because um, the controls in the game are used to convey emotion, and you're not going to get that by watching it at all. And, and I say controls... This game, when you go to Steam page, it'll say this game must be played with a controller, and that's not entirely true. The first time I played through this game, I did it with a keyboard and mouse, and I had no problem. With There were two instances where I had problems. Like, there was a crank in there that you gotta wind up, and it's not easy to do on the keyboard like it is on a controller. But don't pay attention to that. If you don't like controllers and you just want to do it on a keyboard and mouse, you can definitely play this game with a keyboard and mouse. Don't pay attention to any of the Steam reviews that say you can't. They're lying. With that said, I'm going to try it with a, key with a controller. I am not very um, good with controller. I, I'm not a controller person. I My last console I owned was a Sega Dreamcast way back in the day, and I haven't really used a controller since. So, I, 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 used, I have a Steam controller, and I used it a little bit to play Rocket League, of which I'm not very good at all. So, I, I don't know... I'm not good with controllers. So, I, I thought this would be a good opportunity for me to play with a controller, and just to get used to a controller and whatnot. So here we are, Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons. Um, start is not that button, it's that button. So before we hop into this, um, one thing I want to point out is that the dialogue in here, the voice acting, it is not done in English. It, it is not done in any language, in fact, it's a, it's a made-up... Um, I don't want to say it's a made-up dialogue. I mean, they don't have any kind of secret language that they're using. It's just made-up noises to convey emotion. And you're supposed to plug in what you feel that they're saying. It's pretty obvious what these people are saying. Um, and you could probably get the vibe by now, too, that it's it's not exactly a, a, um, a happy game. It is a... a mostly sad story it's got happy parts in it as well so so don't worry about that but um if this is your first time you should probably grab some tissues i should be okay since i've already gone through that phase all right we'll play a, a new game here yes i i already tested the game out make sure that i can do it with a controller and get my frames and all that jazz the aesthetic is gorgeous i mean it may not be um it, it may not have the you know the best textures, but it's not really the point of this game. It's the style that counts. It's the music that accompanies it, with this with the the singing, this voice that you're hearing. So he's lost his mother. He's he's watched her drown right in front of him. Thank you. 
Nayi! Ta! Ata Nayi! Ata! And now they're losing their father. So prepare yourself. I'm telling you. All right. So the thing that um, sets this game apart from from most games is the way it uses the controls. You. This is actually a single person co-op game in that I actually control both little brother and big brother with each side of the controller. So the right pad controls little brother, the, the the left pad controls the big brother. And I can tell you right now, I'm not good at it. So don't expect professional play here. I'm not good at it at all. But that's okay. I think you guys can struggle through it with me. So our dad is sick and we got to we got to take him we got to get some help. Now this is um this is a it is a story driven game. There there is a story that's that's very important to the gameplay. But it is a it is a puzzle game. And the puzzles aren't terribly complicated. They're they're more to convey emotion. Just like everything in this game is 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 done to convey emotion. So we got little brother over here. I got to pull this letter to get us across and he's not strong enough to do it. However, big brother is. So you can get, kind of get a sense on what, what kind of puzzles we're going to have. Some things the brother, the big brother can do because of his size. Grab it. And other things. Whoa, help him out, bro. I don't know. Can you? There we go. And, and some things little brother can do because of his size. They don't have names. Just big brother and little brother. All right, so let's go down here, and you'll see that little brother can't reach. So I need to get the big brother over here. However, he doesn't try to jump. He wants to help the little brother up. There you go. We let the rope down. He can climb up now. I don't know why he just couldn't grab onto the ladder, but there you go. So we have this crank here. And this is where the controller comes in handy. This was actually difficult to do on a keyboard. The game just wasn't made to be played on the keyboard. So I didn't have a problem until I ran into this crank, and it was a little difficult, but I got through it. But after this, it's mostly smooth sailing on a keyboard, so don't let don't let that scare you if you end up playing this. God, it can be so difficult to control both of them at the same time. I actually had an easier time on the keyboard. Alright, let's go, bros. Good thing he lives next door to us, right? This oceanfront property. Probably could have taken the cart a little closer. Isn't that pretty? It's a pretty game. Like I said, the, the textures aren't exactly high res, but they don't they don't need to be. So that's a map with a big tree on it. So you can get the gist of what he's saying. We have to go on a journey. Fetch some ingredient or reagent or whatever. So we have our... We have our plat. Our goal is to to find that tree and and save our father because we've already we've just lost our mother. I keep on thinking little brother is the left. I don't know why. 
Oh, for Pete's sake. Just beat his ass! Freaking brat. <laughs> Just beat his ass! Damn trolls. Alright, we gotta go around actually. So he can't swim. Traumatized by by his mother, he's he's afraid of water. So uh, once again, um, we need to use both guys. Big brother hops in there. Little brother follows him in and, and gets on his back. And what's interesting about this is I'm using the left side of the controller to to steer the big brother and swim, and I'm using the right side to hold on with the little brother. And, and not many games do that, you know? Can you name one that does something like this? I can't. There may be one that exists, but I don't know what it is. You little brat. I'm gonna kick your ass. Alright. But, once again, we don't go there. We go here. Uh, how do I do this? Alright. I'm not going to be very good at the controller, so be patient with me. Uh, jump. There we go. See the little things, like the birds sitting on the ledge and they fly away. And you'll see up here. Hold or rotate the camera. Um... You can control the camera. It's not entirely necessary. The game does a very good job of controlling the camera for you. I guess only one can sit. And this is another uh, a, a neat little thing added to the game. It doesn't really affect the gameplay at all. But they have these benches scattered about and you can sit in them and it gets you a view of a town or, or something else. And it, it's very pretty. It, it doesn't really serve... The gameplay in any way, but it but it helps immerse you in the story, you know? Can I... I was just going to say, why can't I get up there? Grab a hold. Can I not? There we go. See, look at how well that camera works. There's that little bastard. <laughs> Beat his ass! Well, he's not gonna let us in, but I can sneak through here with the little bro. Nice dog. We got a crank here, and we can do this. Now look at him run like a little wimp from this tiny dog. You jerk. Fantastic. Alright, taunt him as we go by. Look at him cower from that little dog. Asshole. People just chilling. <laughs> that is one giant cat. Look at that thing. So, it has been a couple years since i played this, so I'll remember some of the puzzles, but I'm not going to remember all of them. Another bench. Can I sit on it with both of them? Yes, I can. See, isn't that pretty? Alright, enough of that. Let's get a move on. Hey, 
Your father's dying. Put a little more effort into it, big brother. Like that. That's cute. All right. Let's get big brother over here now. Bam! We're in business. Get a move on, guys. Fantastic. Isn't that a lovely game? It's a cute little game. Alright, what do we got here? Let's go talk to this lady, if we can. He's making a mess. What does the little kid do? <laughs> All right, I think there's a guy over here. Wasn't there? Oh, an old lady. Ma, when are they? Gee, thanks for your help. We were already going that way, Granny. Isn't that cute? That's so cute. Bam! Oh! Oh, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it! How do I shoot? I don't know how to shoot. No, 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 no. Ah, there we go. I have no idea how this works. <laughs> Let's throw it down here. There's your stupid ball. Yeah, laugh all you want. You don't have a ball anymore. Um... Anything over here? No. No. We can't go through any of these doors. Let's go talk to this guy. She's making a mess right in front of the guy. It's funny. Um, I think we gotta grab a hold of this, don't we? Yeah, there we go. Too easy. Um. All right, let's go talk to this guy down here first. Just walk right up there and play it. <laughs> um, did I... Did I need to go down this way? I don't think it mattered. Unless you want to hear the, the harp. What'd you think it was? Little brat. My big brother is big brother on any. Whoops. Fine, we'll do it ourselves. I don't know if he's supposed to be asking for directions or if he is asking for help. Probably both, right? I don't think there's anything in here I can interact with. Let's move our camera around a little bit. 
now. There's a big old dog. That's a problem. All right, so I gotta. Oh no! I gotta distract the dog, but I'm not. Run! Oh, that was close. Okay, which way do I need to go? That way? I think, uh... Oh, boy. Run! Alright, let's get the little brother done. Big brother's safe. Yeah, I'm coming. Chill out, bro. <gasps> Whoa. I wonder what happens when the dog catches him, or if he can. I don't know how that works. Alright, down the slide. More water. Okay, got some vines. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go ahead and grab some. There we go. All right, beautiful waterfall. What we got down there? I didn't do that. Did I do that? I guess I touched the pad with my thumb. The steam pads can be a little sensitive sometimes. All right, so we know what to do here already. Big brother. Grab the little brother. Good thing someone left this behind, right? The puzzles do get more complicated than this later on, by the way. Not terribly complicated, though. That's not the point of the game, to give you, you know, really difficult puzzles. Um, I guess... What do I gotta do here? There we go. Nope, 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 nope. I'm not touching the right one. Left one, I mean. Alright, jump up there. There we go. What have we here? Some kind of farm or something or another. Let's check out this bird. Way to go! He's such a little brat. Got another place to sit down. This is great for thumbnails, isn't it? Although I'm still on the first episode. Alright. Which way we gotta go now? Not that way. So we got a hamster wheel. And who do I want in this? Maybe a little brother? Which way do I gotta go? There we go. I don't know how to... I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Do I bring a sheep across? I think I do. I don't remember why, but I think I do. Look at those sheep, they're gigantic. Oh, that's right, we put the sheep in the wheel, Jesus Christ. I remember now. Grab it! Don't let him run! How do I... how do I... Do I want him this way, or do I want him the other way? Does it matter which way he's running? Alright, it doesn't matter which way he's running. Some intuitive, uh, stuff there, isn't it? Um, go over this way. I keep on getting it mixed up. I keep on thinking little brothers on the left. I don't know why. Um, I, I did it again. I did it again. I'm probably going to do it a lot.
starting to rain, or it's about to rain. I hear the thunder. Holy cow. All right, I think that that seems to be about a good time to end the first episode on a cliffhanger. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I didn't really mean it. Anyways, that's Brothers A Tale of Two Sons. You can get it on Steam. You can get it at Humble. I'm pretty sure you can get it on GOG. I don't remember. But you can usually get it for $10. It goes on sale of a lot for $3. In fact, the last sale was at like $1.50. And you ought to just pick it up. It's like a, you get about three hours of gameplay, but you'll get three hours of gameplay that you probably never experienced before. And um, it's well worth it. So thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.